at around 210 wildfires since the beginning of March 1st. And uh, our five-year average for this time is right around 230. Even during a pandemic, Mother Nature doesn't take time off, especially during wildfire season. In much of Western Canada, there's a common refrain as to why she might be busy in 2021. We saw a little bit less moisture uh, this winter. And one of the key factors is, is just how quickly that snow uh, melts into the ground. If it runs off really quickly, uh, not a lot of that moisture gets into the ground. This marks the second pandemic wildfire season with many of the lessons from year one still in effect for round two. Firefighters are in close contact with one another, so they have to be extra cautious when, when riding in a vehicle. They have to make sure they're, they're spaced out, they have masks on, the vehicles wiped down before and after they get into it. Large-scale evacuations, such as this one near Tomahawk, Alberta, or even this massive inferno at a St. Albert Seniors home, have people pondering if the rescues are COVID safe. Officials say the same safety protocols are in effect. Those locations, you know, they, they do put the effort forth to make sure, you know, people aren't, aren't staying outside of their cohort and, and that they are separated as much as possible. And this year, maybe starting off uh, you know, with a bit more of a bang, I think. The Canadian Forest Service found a year-over-year -year uptick in wildfires. And while they're projecting potentially extreme condition in central Canada and southern BC, no region is immune. Just because the temperatures aren't summer-like doesn't mean that fire doesn't happen. You know, all we need is a you know, dry fuel and uh, maybe a windy day and, and things can get going pretty good. Wildfire numbers came in below projections in 2020 with a key driver that is still in effect now. COVID restrictions probably helped reduce the number of human-caused fires and we can probably see that again in 2021. And with COVID spreading like wildfire in Alberta, Officials hope residents taking in the great outdoors won't allow wildfires to spread like, well, wildfires. If you're having a, a campfire, just make sure you don't leave it unattended. Fully extinguish it before you leave by soaking it, stirring it, soaking it again. Scott Frolic, City News, Edmonton.